Hey guys, it's Friday, December 14th, and I'm here with another video. Uh, it's about 2 a.m. on Friday. I just want to make a quick video to talk about Final Battle 2012. You'll have to forgive the um, audio and video quality. I'm doing the direct upload just to see how it is, how the quality is, and stuff like that. Um, I'm very excited for Sunday. I guess it's a big day for ROH fans. We've got the biggest pay-per-view of the year, Final Battle 2012. And then later in the day, we've got Tyler Black's first um, WWE uh, pay-per-view match. So real, his first real WWE pay-per-view match. So I'm very excited about that. Big day for ROH fans. I'm really, really, really excited for Final Battle 2012. Steam vs. Generico in the Ladder War should be great. I think this is my like most the mo the match I've been anticipating the most of all time. Like it really is. I'm very excited about this match. I love the I love the graphic that they have now. The half that they're using to advertise the half Steam face, half Generico face, and they actually released the shirt for that, which I definitely had to pick that up. I um, really like that shirt, really like that image. But I guess I'm going to talk about the ROH card, really. I'm not really going to talk about the undercard too much, because I really want to just talk about the Steam Generico match and what you guys think is going to happen. But um, let's go through part of the undercard. I'm not going to touch on all the matches, because I think some of them will be forgettable. But... Let's see. Okay, well, we'll ha we have, I guess, Jerry Lynn's, uh, supposed. It's, I guess it's supposed to be his last ROH match. Uh, we'll see about that, but hopefully he'll bring his A game and it'll be a good match. I'm not really excited about the world's greatest tag team match. Um, Adam Cole versus Matt Hardy. When I found out Matt Hardy was going to be in, was coming to Final Battle, I was really pissed off. I didn't want to see him at all. It, was, it just really, I love ROH and I didn't really want to see Matt Hardy there. But... I don't know. I think it'll be good because he he's got the name value. I res and don't get me wrong. I respect Matt Hardy for everything he did in the WWF and everything he's done in the past. But I don't know. Just at this point in his career, I just hope it doesn't derail anything Adam Cole is doing right now. Hopefully he'll bring his A game and it'll be a good match. But he'll definitely draw some people and hopefully get some people that aren't into ROH to start watching ROH and help the company out a little bit. But I don't know. We'll see. We'll see Sunday, I guess. It'll be cool to see the American Wolves tagging together again. Uh, we've got the Michael Elgin versus Roderick Strong match. Hopefully it'll be as good as his match versus Davey Richards at Showdown in the Sun Day 2. We'll see if, if that's going to be the case. And now we have the tag team match. And I guess we'll be able to tell by the tag team match probably what's going to happen in the t world title match. Because I think if Scum, if Steve Carino and Jimmy Jacobs drop the belts, I don't think there's any way Steen's retaining and vice versa. But who knows? And if they do drop the belts, who are they going to give them to? The Briscoes? Is it going to is it going to be their eighth title run, or are they going to give it to Caprice Coleman and Cedric Alexander? I think it could be a a good time to put them over and give them the belts, but we'll see. And I didn't want to spend too much time on all that, so I'm just going to go right into um, the latter war, Steam versus Generico. I don't know. I'm just really curious to see what's going to happen. I've been reading a lot of theories and what people think is going to happen. And the thing that seems to be what a lot of people think is that Steam's going to drop the belt to Generico, and then uh, Jay Lethal's going to come and do his little thing where it's like his cash-in and go home with the belt. And it's one of those things where it's like, I don't want that to happen, but it sounds very logical and like it's most likely going to happen, especially with all the stipulations and stuff that are going on. So I think that's probably what's going to happen. I don't really want that to happen, though. I either want Steen to retain or Generico to have a title run, but I don't think Generico, they're going to give the belt to Generico because he's not really a permanent member of the roster right now with all the stuff he's doing in Evolve and Dragon Gate and all that. But I don't know. I am just I guess I'm just curious to see what all you guys think. What do you think is going to happen? Do you think Steen, Steen will retain or if he'll give the belt to Generico? I'd love to see Generico have a run, but I don't really think that's going to happen with the, all the circumstances and stuff. But... I don't know. I guess it'd be a great time for a lethal time to give lethal the belt, but I don't know. I guess we'll see Sunday. I'm really excited about it. Also, after that, hopefully we'll have a great ladder war, and then they'll do something cool with um, Tyler Black in the at TLC later in the night. But curious to see what you guys think about um, Final Battle and what's going to happen. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching. Hopefully the video wasn't too shitty, the uh, direct upload. Thanks a lot, guys. Uh, talk to you soon, and hopefully Sunday is awesome. See you later.